Hey everybody, Sean Tubbs here. This is a John McGuire Valley Pro Stratocaster. Now before I go into the specs on this guy, um, a little bit of background on it. I used to actually play uh, a guitar uh, back in the in the late 80s, early 90s that was built by a company called uh, Valley Arts Guitars. And they just built amazing guitars. Steve Lukather played them. Uh, I think Larry Carlton had a signature model. Uh, of course, Steve did. Um, they were around from the 80s into the early 90s. I, I believe it was 92 when there was a terrible fire at the factory and uh, production of the Valley Arts guitars basically ceased. Um, they were subsequently bought out by, I believe, uh, Samick. And they took a swing at building them, but they were never quite the same guitar. And then I think after that, even uh, Gibson acquired the name and took a swing at it, but never really mm, got it. Um, this guitar has got it. And the reason it does is it's built by John McGuire. Mike McGuire is his father, and he was the owner of Valley Arts Guitars. And I actually bought my Valley Arts uh, direct from Mike uh, back in the day. And it was just a fabulous guitar. And this guitar really kind of pays homage uh, to those guitars with the EMG pickups and and everything he's done with them. You know, the Floyd Rose, the whole the whole deal. So yeah, let me uh, let me tell you the specs really quick on it. Uh, it's a 25 and a half inch uh, scale guitar inch and three quarter uh, nut, ebony fretboard, 6105 frets. The, uh, the back of the neck is beautiful bird's eye maple. Uh, looks really, really nice. The neck shape is kind of a semi asymmetrical uh, shape. It's a little, a little bit wider, but still feels uh, really comfortable. Uh, the body is uh, ash. Uh, it's got a Floyd Rose original trim. Uh, pickups are EMG uh, SA singles, and this is an 85 uh, humbucker. I think what I had in mind was two SAs and an 81. On the back, it's got a really nice cutaway contour, uh, really, really nicely done. Every single one of these guitars is uh, uh, built uh, by hand by John. Um, now, this is kind of a, a specific model, the Valley Pro, but you can, you can talk to him and have him build you, uh, you know, uh, whatever spec you would like, um, whether it be, well, I'd rather have a swamp ash body or an alder body or an all maple body or a rosewood fretboard. Stuff like that can be sorted out. Um, oh, by the way, the, uh, the radius on this neck is compound 10 to 16. And I used to not be a big fan of compound radius necks, but uh, I guess as I've gotten older and more mellow about things, <laughs> um, I'm, I'm way more into them uh, because you can get kind of a vintage feel down here, but when you want to bend notes and, and have a little bit lower action up tall, uh, up higher, you can, you can do that. So I, I don't think I missed any other specs. Oh, five-way uh, uh, switch on the guy, and it's got Schaller strap locks and uh, Goto tuners. So yeah, really sweet guitar. Um, yeah, I'll just give you guys a listen. Uh, and uh, you, can, you can see what you think. Uh, let's just start with the first pickup. I'll, I'll go ahead and stay uh, clean for now. So this is the neck position EMG uh, SA. <laughs> we'll go to the in between. So now we've got second position neck and middle. And here is just the middle pickup. the fourth position, so middle and bridge. Now 
Now keep in mind with this one, I think it's the 89 you can split. This one you can't split. The 85 uh, bridge humbucker is, is fairly hot and it's pretty fat in the mid. So with this thing, if you want to get a little less of the, the um, kind of bridge, I, I, I even though you, you can't individually back the pickups, I just back the volume off a little bit. And that works fine. And then of course the bridge. And yeah, it's a pretty darn hot pickup. Uh, these are active pickups. And I haven't used EMGs in years, but it's, it's bringing back a lot of memories for sure. <laughs> Um, they, they, do, they do sound great. They've got kind of this bell-like. Just cool kind of thing about them that only really EMG does. Okay, so real quick, I'll let you hear uh, just some dirt on them. Got to have some dirt on them. Uh, so here's the neck position. Middle. Actually, the bridge sound, I really dug. That's kind of what I used for the... Uh... And it actually cleaned up really good uh, without really even backing off. I was kind of doing that. Here's the uh, number two position. Number four position. And then uh, I added just a little more gain on the bridge position for the whole, uh, the, uh, I don't remember what I played. It was something like that. So that's the Valley Pro. Really great guitar. If you've got any questions, go to the website and ask away. And as always, thank you so much for tuning in, and I'll have another uh, video uh, demo coming up soon. Thanks, guys.